In this video, we'll showcase the design space creation, model setup, and management capabilities for topology optimization. First, we'll look at the global design space process. There are three key enablers, a design space library, collision detection for improved package management control, and the advanced Boolean voxel meshing engine. Here we show the various representations being loaded from the design space library. You can see the wheel envelopes, the multiple engine variants, plus many more subsystems. These are areas where you do not want the design space to be created. Once you've read in the design and non-design subsystems, you can position them to explore different design variants. Using the Move tool allows you to move the and position the subsystem, and if the collision detection option is activated, it will prevent the subsystem from passing through another. The final step is the voxel design space creation process. Here you can select the include and exclude entities, which will essentially define where the voxels will be created. Creating the design space symmetrically is available. This ensures the design space is symmetric, but also reduces the voxel cleanup by 50%. Voxel editing allows you to select faces for the addition or removal of voxels. There may be overspill areas that need cleaning up, or you might want to make large scale change, for example, going from a panoramic roof to a fixed roof. With the optimization problem setup defined, you now have a run-ready topology optimization. The local design space process allows you to create the design space within a very specific area or region of the model. The added benefit is that the design space is automatically connected to the structure via tie contact. Sometimes it's necessary to prepare the model, therefore patching and filling of gaps may be needed. Next, you need to define the voxel size, select the location and adjust the box for the design space. Now the first local design space is created. Using symmetry, you can select the first design space and create the design space on the other side of the vehicle. With both design spaces created, simply set up the optimization problem and now you have a run ready topology optimization. There may be cases where you'll need to connect the design space to the structure. There are two options, using tie contact or RBE3. For the RBE3 connectivity, you'll need to define a tolerance, select the design space, select the structure you want to connect to, and then you'll see the RBE3 elements are now created between the design space and the structure. 